welcome back to another episode or another vlog we're doing. Yeah. So we thought we'd do it a bit differently. So rather than doing it a month long, we thought we'd do uh, topics. So this one is on yeah. a new product development that we're doing with a with a, a close brewery. So I got a call up just before Christmas, I think it was. Um, and they were looking to try and utilize the, the pool pumps they've got at their, 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 their pubs and thought of this and heard of this product called a graph, which I'll let Ben explain. Yeah, so basically a graph is, is a com combination of beer, beer and cider. So Brewpoint wanted to find a local cider and, uh, and work with us to, to try and create something a bit different, unique to put on their taps to utilize them a little bit more. So, you know, we love a challenge, we love developing different products, so we jumped at the chance. So we trotted over to, to Brewpoint and tried a whole range of their beers, um, and we found one that worked really well, which was a West Coast Pale Ale um, called Alpha. And it paired, because it's quite hoppy, it paired very well with our cider that was drier, so it com they combined very well together. So we did a lot of taste testing, and finally, came up with a recipe that, that worked well. Yeah, so the, the Alpha works an absolute treat and um, we then had to do a number of taste tests, working out what the right combination was. And um, yeah, we went back with, with to the guys at, at Brewpoint and we did a, did a blind taste test and there was a, a clear winner. Mm. Um, but it then it meant that we had 10 days uh, to turn around and get everything produced ready for the event that they want to launch at. So um, it was all, you know, Go. But we managed to get it done, and you know, and it went down an absolute treat. Yeah. You know, the amazing thing is, we never really thought, you know, okay, beer and cider that sounds a bit weird. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I went to X University, and on Rugby Socials, we drank snake bites, which is basically the same thing, but with blackcurrant in. But this was was actually really refreshing. It's yeah. a bit like a little shandy, but you know, with a hoppy hoppy shandy. And it's yeah. just really refreshing, really tasty. So normally, when we produce our ciders, they go into our kegs, which are carbonated. Um, but this is slightly different because it's going on those those ale pumps, the taps, so they're not carbonated. So it meant that we fired up our um, bag in a boxer. So all the product was going into bag in a boxes, which is slightly different, but we do that with our mold cider anyway. So it wasn't anything that we weren't used to. Um, and yeah, it all went quite well. Yeah, so obviously we just launched, so you know it's not readily available. But uh, at the moment, as I am currently aware, it is stocked in the Brew Point uh, in Bedford and the Burley Arms in Cambridge. But hopefully, you know, it will start rolling out more places. Yeah. So we'll get some customer feedback. Um, the guys at Brew Point will see how things are going down, and then I'm sure we'll be rolling out to many more places. So if you're a pub listening and interested. Give us a shout. Yeah, yeah. It was, honestly, it was it, yeah. Love, love the experience, the development. You know, it was it's quite rewarding. You know, pulling the first pint at, at Brew Point, and you know, it it tasted great. And, and it's always nice to collaborate with a local brewery, which are close to us. So it was good fun to work closely with them. I hope you've enjoyed watching how we produced and uh, created the graph. Um, and let us know any feedback you might have for the next vlog we do. Yeah. And any, yeah, if, let us know in the comments if you'd like to see anything else, any other topics you'd like us to cover. Uh, yeah, and the usual spiel was it like and subscribe? Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> like, subscribe, and comment. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Cheers.